to go. Yes. Come on, oh, come on, come on. Come on. Yes. Don't you want to go? Hallelujah. Oh yeah, I want to go. Come on, come on, come on. Mm -hmm. Don't you want to go? Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Don't you want to go? Come on, come on, come on. Don't you want to go? Oh, yes. Yes, sir. I want to go. Yes, sir. Wanting to go is one thing, but making preparation. Amen. We're going to teach a subject. Comfort. Mm. Comfort. Comfort. We're going to begin at Psalm 91. Comfort. Comfort. Psalm 91. Yes. He that dwell in the secret place of the Most High mm -hmm. ain't going to be kicked all about, ain't going to be snatched all the right about. He shall abide. He shall live well. Well, in the, under the shadow of the yes, Almighty. Almighty. That's where we are. Mm. Yeah. I will say to the Lord, He's my refuge. A refuge is where you go and can't nothing get you. That's right. Get inside Christ. That's safety there. Amen. I will say to the Lord, He's my refuge. Mm -hmm. And my fortress. Now, fortress is a refuge with a whole bunch of stuff around it. You can't get to you. Jesus is all that to us. Amen. I will say the Lord, He's my refuge. Yeah. He's my He's my refuge. He's my friend. He's my fortress. Yes, my yes. God. Amen. Yes, sir. The next two words are very important. In him. In him. Mm -hmm. Will I trust? Trust. trust. <laughs> Surely he shall deliver you from the snare of the fowler, that's the trick of the devil, mm -hmm. and from the noisome pestilence. Look, he shall cover you with his feathers like a mother chicken cover her little bitties. And under his wings shall you trust. His truth, his word, shall be your shield <clears throat> and your buckler. What? His truth. Mm -hmm. Yes. Shall be your shield. Lift it up so a thing can't come to you. Uh -huh. And your buckler, your total deliverance. Yes. God is all this stuff. Amen. They shall not be afraid of the terror by night. Now, you ain't got to go way back in Bible time. People are killing, not just in America. Amen. The devil ain't just an America devil. Amen. <laughs> Thou shalt not be afraid. You can stop right there and go in heaven. Yes, sir. Afraid of what? Nothing. Thou shalt not be afraid of the terror. What's, come, what's the next two words? By night the devil wake in darkness to hide himself. Not the night of darkness, but the confusion that he brings to you. Nor by the error that fly by day. Nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness. Nor for the destruction that wasted at noonday. Mm -hmm. Look at it now. Psalm 91 7. A thousand shall fall yes, sir. at your right side. You didn't knock them down. God knocked them down. Yes, sir. And 10,000 shall fall at your right hand. <laughs> but read it. It shall yeah. not, not come nigh right. you. All hell can be raised, can't you? Yes, sir. You got to hide in me. His name is Jeep. His name is, his name is, yes, 
Lord. Jesus. Psalm 91 and 8. Only with your eyes shall you behold and see the reward of the wicked, but you don't take no joy in it. That's right. Amen. When God starts dealing with your adversary, your enemy, don't rejoice. You take that thing off the enemy and put it on you. That's right. Psalm 91 9. The God that has made the Lord. You need to get this. <clears throat> Psalm 91 and 9. Because you have made the Lord, which is already my refuge. Amen. Huh? Even the most high, you have a tissue. You live inside God. There shall no evil befall you. Amen. Neither shall any plague come nigh your dwelling. For God shall give his angels charge over you. Amen. What's the next three words? To, to keep, keep you. you. You angels are angels are looking over for you now. Amen. Amen. Not one angel, angels. Amen. God did that. How do you think in, in, in two months I'm going to be 86? I ain't got nothing to do with that. Amen. Amen. Here's a statement. Only by what? The grace. Oh, God. Mm. Oh, man. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. By the grace of God. I got smart last night, so I'm going to go to bed early and get me some red. Hell, mercy. Mm. <laughs> yes, sir. I've been there. And yeah, then. I wouldn't tell the Lord, I want to sleep now. I want to, I want to sleep. Mm -hmm. He talked, he talked, he talked, <laughs> he talked. So this morning at 6 o'clock, I just got to take my shower. He ain't going to be the no noise. Isn't it wonderful that God can make us in such a way that he can come to us and just relax and talk to him. Amen. What is man that I should be mindful of him? Well, the sort of man that I should consider him. I made him a little lower than angels and crowned his head with glory. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's the word of God right there. You are crowned with glory. I don't care what the stuff is going on around you in your home. Your relatives, your boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife, or this book. I don't care what's going on the outside. God has crowned you with glory. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Can't you give him a clap hand on that? It ain't got to do with the bill, Joe, you can't pay. Amen. There's a bill that none of us was able to pay. Amen. Amen. Thank you. The price yes. of salvation. Yes, yes. And somebody wrote a song about that. Free at last. Yes. Free at last. Look what they give the credit. Mm. Thank God Almighty. Now this is the thing that will get you to the doors of glory. I am free. Hear it. I'm free. I ain't free from debt. My gas ain't free. My car ain't free. My house ain't free. I didn't say those things was free. Thank God Almighty, I am finally free. Free from what? The yoke of the bondage of sin. If I die right now, don't you come up here shed your tears on me. Don't get quiet on Amen. me now. Amen. If I lay down now, yes, I, 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 it was a long time I couldn't say this, you see. I proclaimed it, you know. Yeah. Free at last. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Free at last. Thank God Almighty. Yes, thank you. Thank you. See, I can't say that for you. 
Thank God Almighty, I am free. At last, finally, I let God crucify my old man. crucified my old man. Mm -hmm. Now down south, a married, a married woman, they say her husband is her old man. Mm -hmm. You see how tricky that devil is? Mm -hmm. He know that we're the wife of Christ. But he ain't gonna say that. Old man, your husband. <clears throat> Jesus is a man. Honey, he ain't, he ain't old. Amen. He ain't old. Amen. My subject is comfort. The ninth verse in Psalm 91. Because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, mm -hmm. even the most high, your habitation, your hiding place, mm -hmm. there shall no evil befall you. Now, if I just put an arrow right there and stop, you got that in your spirit, you go home, you're free. Amen. You got to believe this. Amen. But the very book that wrote it will give you faith to believe it. Yes. Amen. Faith come by what? Yes. Hearing and hearing by the word of God. So I have to read the word to you so you can hear the word that brings faith to you to make you free from you. Amen. Are y'all not there? So we we ain't about none. Hey, we we ain't about none. Amen. <laughs> we ain't we ain't we ain't we ain't about none. This statement is applicable. No, I ain't much, but only by the grace grace of God. I am what I am. What I am. And Amen. before that, God said, He just blew you away. You wasn't nothing. But now you are anchored in Christ by the word of God. Amen. So the storm can come. Miles can loose against you. Yes. Job can lay you off. Really? Your bills bigger than your money. Amen. You still got the victory. Amen. Come on here. You still got the victory. The 11th verse in Psalm 91. For God shall give his angels charge over you. God is making his angel responsible for you. Amen. That's in the physical realm. The angels standing here, you'll be able to sleep. That lock don't keep them out. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Somebody I know that used to be in my family was coming in and I was trading any time he get ready. Just come in here and take what he would. And I'm just as happy and didn't know nothing. Till he took a eleven hundred dollar barbecue pit and I asked my son, Did you take that pit? He said, No, is it gone? <laughs> I said, Yeah. Locks. Don't keep the devil. Amen. Joy. Don't keep him out. They will anoint you. Amen. Now I found out what he's doing, so I changed the lock. I walk naturally into the spiritual blessing that God has shown me. You don't have to leave the door open to test God to see if the devil going to come in. He's already in you. <laughs> don't try God. Believe God and rest in God. Because if we we're not the Lord on our side, may if you say. <laughs> the devil will swat us up just like that. Amen. But the Lord is yes. on our side. Thank you, Jesus. When I go to heaven, I told you this 239,000 times. Don't let nobody sit here that's not reading this word to you. Amen. Because the word is true. 
And if you believe the word living, it will make you free. Only the truth will defeat a lie. Only salvation will defeat the soul of Satan. Satan is too smart for us. But you see, if he can't find us, we got a hiding place. We got a hiding place. Huh? Our life is inside Christ. That's inside God. We're being taught by the Spirit of the Holy Ghost. He comes. And see, sometimes the Holy Ghost let us bump our head against the wall. Just boom, boom, boom. And let me say, what? Who told you to do that? Who told you to play that number? Y'all got my quiet. Like, you know what number says. I'm lying to you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Who gave this person a dream about a number? Mm -hmm. Wasn't Jesus? You heard from a demon. Mm -hmm. You can dream it, but don't play it. Amen. And when you love God enough, love God enough, the devil has to back up from you. He can talk to you, but he got to do it at a distance. Ha uh ha, -huh, girl, this is because you are surrounded with love, and God is what? Love, he can't come through God to get to you. Amen. We got to be so spiritually wise to become intellectually dumb. The devil don't know how to get to us. Amen. Because we got a hiding place. He don't need to know where the place is. In Jesus we live, help me with it, and move, and what? Have I been? We live inside Jesus. There ain't no bills in Jesus. Amen. He paid it. Yes, yes. So we have to see the natural world as the natural world, the spiritual world, the spiritual world. And when the natural mind my, my world gets too strong, it's because we're thinking on it. And as a man thinking is hard work. So is he? We got to keep our mind stayed, glued to what God said. What God said in the world don't make no kind of sense. But it's working. I'm telling you, I'm almost 86. It's got to be working. Hey, it's got to be. It's got, it got to be working. When I go to see my wife, she just said, man, no you be talking to us. As soon as I get close to her, she tells me the word nurse. This is my husband. This is a good man. Now he's trying to talk to him. Mm. <laughs> they ain't got nothing to say. Amen. We know. Well, I'm going to talk for myself now. I know that God heal me yes. when I pray. Ain't no doubt Amen. about that. And I know his answer is not always yes. Sometimes it's weak. Now, nah, that's a hill to climb now. Amen. I said, Lord, I'm almost 88 or something. Mm -hmm. to I ain't got long to be here. He still said it there. Wait. Do you know what waiting does? It gives us an opportunity to see if God really is faithful. Sometimes that thing we've been praying for, he would hold it. Because we are praying about it. We're talking to him. That's what he want. Amen. <laughs> are y'all listening to me? When you read God's word, God is talking to you. Amen. Amen. Now sometimes he said, blessed art thou. And sometimes he said, Thou shalt not. Except both of those things. Amen. 
if you're not wiser than he, mm -hmm. the Lord, this is personal, is my shepherd. You don't know about that because you ain't never been down south. The shepherd's job is to do whatever is necessary to secure the sheep. To make things well with the sheep. To keep the sheep happy. To shut out the wolf and the dogs. The Lord is my everything. Look. So I shall not what? Want because he's everything I need. Some of the saints couldn't get away to church. But they're here now. Amen. Another saint said, I make a phone call and have to pick you up. Hey, you... You got to love this book, man. He said, love ye what? One another, for love ye is a God. If somebody's stranded, give them some transportation. See what? Pray for them. If they're hungry, feed them. Amen. This is a real book here. Amen. Yes. This ain't no funny book. This is the book of life here. Yeah. Jesus said, and as much as you didn't do it to those my little ones, See, there is no such thing as a saint being stranded. Amen. Are you listening to me? Amen. So you go and pick her up or him up. And when you come to church, we're in process. You ain't late, you're right on time. Amen. How come? You was out there obeying what I'm telling you now to do. I need to introduce to this word sacrifice. Oh, God Almighty, man. Let me show you a sacrifice that we think is an Easter speech. God so loved the world. He gave. He did what? He gave. That's a sacrifice. Cost him. Best thing he did. All right. All right. But because Jesus obeyed his father, he went to hell for me. But in three more, call him more such in the head. Hell, nah. Hell, yeah. In three days. Yes. This is the worst sound that they would have ever, ever heard. I am up. Devil yeah. running now. He's in St. Louis. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. And all power. Mm. We've done them whole old such in it. You need to listen to us preacher when we be reading this book. We didn't write it, we're just reading it. Amen. Mm -hmm. Blessed is he that do hear and do what I say. Because obedience is better than what? Sacrifice. What I got to say, I thought I could get everybody to say. Because right. yeah. I saw, I said, how can they miss all this goodness? The Lord said, you did. Mm -hmm. I said, oh, it is right. <laughs> <laughs> I can't, can't you. If it wasn't the Lord who was on our side. Yes, yes, yes. They used to say. If it had not been for the law that was on our side, the devil would have quickly swallowed us up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But the Lord is on our side. On our side. So what can the devil do to us? Absolutely nothing. Attack the flesh sometimes. Attack the car sometimes. I'm going to go slow about this. I'm going to let you think about it. Sometimes the devil can attack your mind. Yes, sir. Lord. Lord. Amen. I hate to try to make it real because I'm on television, but mm. that ain't yours, brother. I know 
it's pretty. I know it's look good, but that ain't yours. Mm -hmm. But the scripture got you covered. As a man think in his heart. Yes, sir. What you just thought about that woman, that tight dress on, etc., etc., that didn't come out of your heart. You're a liar. Look how quiet you are. I thought you said you got to know the truth. The truth would what? Man, don't be ashamed of the truth. If you fall, get up, quick. Dust yourself off and say, Lord, I'm sorry. To help me. Move on. Don't, don't stumble over your own thing. I never heard I said to me, hey, call your heart. You know what I'm thinking. You know what I'm talking about. If it were not the law that was on my side, may, may James say. If it had not been Jesus that was on my side, the devil would have quickly swallowed me up just like that. Now, right now. If I ever needed that, I'm going to go to your head. If I ever. Whew. I'm going to preach to you next week, but I'm going to tell you the truth. If I ever need, I ain't going to say about you because, you know, sometimes you don't think you need it. But if if I ever needed the Lord before, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I sure mm. need him what? Now. Now. I need him every day yes. and every hour. Yes, but you see, when you read this book, this book will tell you that Jesus is available. Susan couldn't get to church. She called another Susan. Susan sent a ride for her, brother to the church. That's what God would do for you when you get to a stumbling block. He will get you over it. Well, let me teach it real to you now. If sister had to cry out, Amen. she wouldn't be here. Amen. Hey, Make known the good deed. Hey, of the Lord upon them. To yes. be ask God and believe it. Yes, yes. And when my son called me, I was ready to shut this church down and go pick that sister up. Mm -hmm. mm. How come? Now she is the church. Sorry. Not here. I'm going to get the church. Amen. Hey, Kaya, you you gotta get that right. Amen. Sometimes I need to tell you about love once I find out what it is. You know, I've been looking all these years trying to find out what love is. Love ain't a what. Love is a man. His name is Jesus. God so loved the world. See, if you want to come to Bible college, I'll get this as deep as you want me to get. But let me tell you something. You shall know the truth. Not maybe you shall know the truth. Yes, sir. And what will that truth do? It will make you free and yeah. keep you free. Because once you know it, now you got to do it. It's not the know of the word that is sanctified, but the do of the word. You got to do what God, you got to do what God tell you. Yeah. Yeah. Come on here. You see, 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 look, look, now you got to understand. We always say the joy of the Lord is our strength. What does that mean? The Holy Ghost is our strength. The Holy Ghost is God. And if we obey God joyfully, we can call him Father. Mm -hmm. We can place him in heaven. Hollow would be the mm -hmm. name. Mm -hmm. Let your kingdom, righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Ghost, let it come upon me now. Mm -hmm. You got to get inside that prayer for that prayer to get inside you. They had a club one time in Flint called it Hip and Hand Club. Can't nobody help you. The Bible said, Oh, my help! Oh, my help! Yes, it is in the book. Yes. All of my help, every bit of it, yes. come down from the, Lord. from the Father above. Yes, he is a good God. He is a good God. Let me tell you something, man. Ain't no mountain high. 
high enough. Ain't no valley low enough. Ain't no problem long enough to keep him away from you. You see, God stands ready now. He ain't on God. He is God. And God is good. I heard it say all the time, no, no, no. He, he's better than time. Because there's going to be a day where God going to call time up out of here. Yes, sir. And all that live in time going to hell. All that live inside Christ that is eternal is going with him. But God has given us a plan. Everybody, even the drunk, knows St. John 3.16. But that's not stopping him from being drunk. It's not the no other word that is justified. You got to do it. Amen. You got to do this book. Yes, and this book has something called the anointing. Glory. You can't understand this book. Oh, I read it for 30 years in the shop. They tell me, you ain't through reading that book yet. He thought this was a regular book. No, it ain't. Amen. This is Christ laid down flat. Lord. If you put your heart in this Bible and believe it with all your soul, a person will come out. His name is Jesus. Mm. His surname is Christ. Lord. Jesus can't get in your heart. He's a flesh man. Lord. His spirit is called Christ. Lord. Jesus came down and glory yeah. filled my soul. Yes, Look what he did. He took my <laughs> oh. he took my sins away. Turned my midnight in the day. Jesus came down and glory filled so, listen, I checked my library, I don't know how many books I got in there. But God has shown me only by the grace of God. <clears throat> I have to go through those books and I read those books to find out what I got out of those books and put in this book got out of this book and put in those book. So if I got to go here to find out who put that, why don't I just read this here? Mm -hmm. i tell you what it says. Mm -hmm. I know you, you might not have heard it before, but God so loved the world. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Mr. Don't get so smart, you forget that. He didn't say God so loved the church. Let me teach you now. I say, the scripture don't say God so loved the church. How come? The church is the body of a person called Christ. So Christ in you is the hope of what? Glory. Glory. Mm -hmm. right. We got to stay simple, man. The thing I'm talking about. And the thing that we are believing is the thing that caused my wife to lighten up when I go in that room. Boy, she, ooh. You see, I didn't know but the woman knew. So they took a beautician out there and fixed the hair real pretty. And they, they put some lipstick or something on her lips, you know. Mm -hmm. And they did something with her eyebrows, you know. Mm -hmm. So I went up to Salvation Army and bought a little mirror. She look at that mirror. She like the way she look. Amen. We have we have helped her to see herself mm -hmm. like she usually is, mm -hmm. and that gives her natural and spiritual hope. Amen. We don't know what she's doing out there. We don't know how come she's there. Let 
just scripture be the scripture. God work in mysterious ways. Mysterious means you don't know what he's doing. Look at the fourth thing. God work in mysterious ways. Look, his wonders mm -hmm. to perform. His wonders is mysterious. Because his working is mysterious. So what we do, we turn it all over to God and we seal it up to God be we don't know nothing. Yes, sir. Hey! We, we, don't, we don't know nothing. But we know a few things. We know God is too good to do wrong. Amen. Well, I do. Amen. We in Psalms. And I'm going to put the clock on me so you relax. 34 after. We'll go to, to the hour. In Psalm 91. Look at the 11th verse. For God shall give his angels, read it, charge over you, read it, to keep you in all of your way. Whatever you go, whatever you're going to do, God got his angels looking over you. Here's the saying ain't got no lie to check. You hear them? Look what we always say now. Ain't nothing too hard for God. God. She couldn't walk from 12 feet over here and be on time. I love God. I love God. Amen. Amen. I love you. Just put up with me. I love God. Because yes. he knows stuff we don't know. I didn't know she didn't have no ride. God knew. She knew. And God made a way. Now she's here. Amen. Come over here. Now, now look at here. Now let God be big. If he did it for her. Amen. Over to you. Amen. Amen. Cause God is not a wreck. Spectre person. Right. I, I need to. You need to get this stuff, man. My God shall supply. Yes. Yes. The next word is what? Oh. 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 Hallelujah. <laughs> oh, I wish you in charge just now. There ain't no need you got that God ain't. Yeah. I like that statement. That, I didn't say no thing you got. No. I said there ain't no need that you got that God ain't. Amen. Another yeah. scripture said, my God shall supply what? Oh. Oh. All of your needs according to the riches and glory what? By Christ oh, Jesus. Jesus. Jesus is in our life. He's operating in our stuff. He wants us to love one another, yes. take care of one another, because we are one body. Yes. Yes, we are one body. And one spirit dwell within. And all her members are redeemed and triumphant over sin. We, we need to hear this. Over and over and over and over till Jesus come. Amen. And when he come and he say, I told you come up here. Now, I'm gonna tell you again because you didn't hear me the last time. He gonna only say it once. Amen. The scriptures say, so be ready. You know that the day of the hour when he gonna what? Come. He gonna say, "Come up here." That's all. Yes. You didn't go. You burn. What's my phone number? I ain't telling it to you. <clears throat> Listen to this now, and don't always write it the wrong way. Yes, Jesus loved me. Yes. Yes, Jesus loved me. Yes, Jesus loved me. Why? Because the Bible tells me so. That's a saint saying that. Yes. What does St. John 3.16 say? God so loved the world. God loved everybody. Yes. But the soul that said must surely die. Mm. So he made preparation to bring every soul to him. Yes. Yes. Because
because God can't break his word. He said the soul that sin must die. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I make preparation. Come to Jesus. Yes. Come to Jesus. Come to Jesus just now, just now. He'll save you. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> I'm going to preach to you next week, but I want to tell you, you got a friend. Yes. You got a friend. And this Bible says he stick closer. Yes. He's better than a twin. He's better than Siamese friends, though. Them twins, they stick together. Amen. They stick together on the outside. <laughs> Jesus stick together on the inside. inside. Look. That's what we dramatize when we take the Lord's Supper. We dramatize put Jesus on the what? Inside. Inside. Mm -hmm. That's not for sinners. I said it's not for sinners. Yeah. You can't get in the church and tell the lies that I'm going to heaven. But you can take that bread and you can take that wine. And just before you eat it, right. you confess your sins. You got here just as saved as the preacher. I come. God don't take no technicalities to keep you out. He died to get you in. Amen. Amen. I, I, I love him. I see like this. Mm -hmm. And Lord, I go to heaven. I want you to give James and Brother Blackman the same amount of time. Please be patient with me. Amen. I ain't going to say that to other part. Mm -hmm. Because God ain't through with me yet. Look at it. I ain't going there with that. Yeah. I'm just going to ask you to be patient with me as I tell you over and over and over. If you need a friend, I stay with you to the end. Call on Jesus. Jesus is the one that saved. If I be for you, help me with you. I'm more than the whole world, that's what? Against, against you. The whole world is against you. But he can't get to you. Because Jesus is for you when you let him come into you. See, to talk about Jesus, I'm not more subtle. I've seen drunks preach better than me. Drunk. Stand up against the wall, wet. Preaching. Look. God has touched that man's head. He can't save you by what's in your head. But I've seen drunk can really preach. But it's not the, it's not the know of the word that is justified. But the doer. Tell you things that happened before you got here. Man came in with a 38 revolver right there. Saturday night. He's up coming tomorrow at 11 o'clock. And if you talk about this Jesus tomorrow, I'm going to blow your brains out. I said, that I'll be teaching at 9 30 in the morning. Amen. When are you preaching? I said, about 11. I'll see you tomorrow. Pow, pow, pow. Empty that gun on the floor between my legs. She started even with my head and I could see the Holy Ghost. This is with me. Been there. Look at it now. Jesus said, if I be for you, you got to live this book. Amen. Hey, you got to do it. You got to, you got to hold God to what he said without fear from that. If I be for you, I am more, not just one man with one pistol, Taking the church money to the bank about 15 years ago. Bank down there on North Saginaw Street. 
We need to get some money out. Man, I met me in the parking lot. Put a gun right there. Give me the money, I'm going to kill you. Now, I don't tell you to say this. Mm. I said, get it done. He starts shaking. Put his, hey, call you I'm talking about my God now. Amen. I'm telling you. That's why I'm long I like to tell you what God has done for me. Yes, sir. Glory. Going to play a concert. He had a brand new Cadillac, my second phone. On the highway, gone near Saginaw mm -hmm. one day. Went to sleep with the feet up the set on 70. The car was in the middle of where the gravel is. Kicking up the gravel. I heard a voice. Tony still wheel loose. And wake up. I saw that story with you. Just like that. He real. Hey! He real. He real! He real! But he's not the kind of God you try. He ain't no joke. Amen. Amen. That's right. Hey, he ain't no joke. This is my husband. This is a good man. Now, I've been married to him for a century or more. I know, but it was when she said it. It lifts up my spirit. I know she's going to say it. Mm -hmm. Amen. She ain't going to look like she's dead. Just so like boom. <laughs> There's something about Jesus yes, yes, yes. that will make you proclaim this is a good <laughs> Savior here. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is my Lord and my Savior. He give me breath, yes. water to drink, mm -hmm. give me a car to drive, bed to sleep in. Give me sweet dreams about his mm. Holy Ghost. He's yes. my friend. He sticks closer than a brother. Yes, Sometimes you need to get happy and preach to yourself. Yes. Yes, preach to yourself. Yes. God is good. Yes. And I got 14 minutes. God is good. Now just don't get up justified. Never mind all that stuff. God is good and that my soul knows. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. I know it's been good to me. Yes. Because I'm looking at 86. But he said, before I formed you in your mother's belly, I knew you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. I didn't exist. He knew me. Yes, sir. Oh, what are you going to do with a God like that? What the? <laughs> Sometimes I say, Lord, I don't know what you be talking about. He said, all you have to do is love me. Yeah. Mm. Trust me. Correct. And by and by, verse 1 to 13, when you stand face to face with my son, hmm. you will know as you are known. Yes, sir. I know everything there is to know about you. Mm. When you lay that body down, it got nothing but questions and false prophets. When you lay that body down, First Corinthians 13, and stand face to face with me, you will have the mind of God without the intellect of the head. You will know as I am known, because then you will truly know who I am, who I am. Yes. By and by. by, and by. But right now, I'm quoting scripture now. Right now, we look to glass Dimly. You prophesy in part. Because we ain't seen it all yet. But we seen enough to say yes, and then yes will get you in, then you'll see it later on. He said, What I tell you now, you don't you don't quite understand it. But I'll come again and you will see me. You will see me as I am. And you will be just like me when you lay that body down. I, I, 
See, I tell you the truth, you know, so you know I ain't no Superman. I, I had problems. I said, Lord, mm -hmm. Peter did the same thing. How come I can't be like you now? And when you ask God with that inquisitive, humble spirit, he will teach you. He told me like he told you, James, I will show you things to come. They haven't got here yet, but I'll show them to you. He told Paul that, I'm going to show you. It ain't even happened yet. He told Jeremiah, Isaiah, one of the prophets, what do you see? He said, I see an almond tree. God said, it ain't there, but I'll perform it because you saw it. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. All right, now. Here's the son you got. And daughter we got. Look like they ain't gonna never get saved. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you know somebody else was thinking the same thing about us? Amen. 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 Mm -hmm. Huh? We can have the love of Christ, the power of Christ, the spirit of Christ, but we ain't ready to have the fullness of the God yet. yet. We got no place to keep it. Mm -hmm. So we run around the church and shout and scream, still ain't gonna get it. Got no place to put it. But one of these days, by and by when the morning comes. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Hey, 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 we will know as we are known. We are known now. Everything that is to know about us, God know. Amen. At the rapture, everything we are to know about God is going to be Jesus. We will see him as he's God Almighty, the keeper. I said, Christ, God, you're going to turn to be the Holy Ghost. Down here now, Christ became Jesus, the body to die for us. Yes, sir. He said, I'm going back to heaven, and because I told you that you're sad in spirit, but if I don't come, the comforter won't come. He said, I'm going to heaven, in a few days I will return to you. Yes, he called on himself, call him, say, the Holy Ghost. <laughs> Nine minutes. Now, I know you have to go to work. And some of you might have husbands that don't understand you stand in church, so and so and so and so and so. And now you have a job to go to, you have to be there, so and so and so. So if you have a need to leave, would God understand that? Amen. There was a time I was working seven days, 12 hours, and I was back in the church. But when I needed to go, I didn't have the people, had the people to know I got to go. I told them, this is the way it is now with me. But the way it is now with me may not be the way it is with you. Amen. At this time. So you're not serving a God that don't understand what called the Lord said to me. Huh? God. He's a people say this like a poetry. God is an all-knowing God. Yeah. 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 He knows everything about everybody. Amen. Now, now, now before you say amen too loud, yeah. I say he know everything right. about everybody. Yes, yes, yes. The good things what? And the bad thing. Well, we can sing this song. Yes, Jesus loved me. Yes, Jesus loved me. Yes, Jesus loved me. How you know? Because the Bible tells me so. A sinner can say that and get scriptural authority. Of St. John 3.16. God so loved the world. So mm -hmm. the kind of sinner can say, God so loved me mm -hmm. that he gave. Mm -hmm. 
Now that thing that he gave, you got to receive. He gave you he, he Hey now, boy, hey! He gave. Yes. Yeah. He gave. And he gave. And he gave. And he gave. Yes. And I hear Jesus talking to his disciples. They're just people like us. Don't make big shots out of them. He said, stay right here and, and, and watch what I go yonder and pray. When he came back, they were asleep. He said, What? Could not you watch for me just one hour while I go yonder and prepare to take your sins away? Every time he left, he come back, they were asleep. When he came back the third time, He says, sleep on now and get your rest. Then the next verse says, awake. We got to go. Mm -hmm. We are awake. We got to go. Lord. If you want to be like God, try to get somebody saved. Not necessarily get them to come here. Right. Try to get them to come to Jesus wherever they are. Mm -hmm. Amen. Father, we thank you. Hey, we thank you. Hey, we thank you. Hey, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you for your love and yeah. your kind and your tender mercy. Yes, Lord. Yes. Lord. Thank you for every family that is represented here. Yes. Yes, Lord. Let them know that you are not a man. You cannot lie. Come into our hearts. Yes. Come into our spirit. Save somebody. Yes, yes. That's why you came. Mm -hmm. Save the soul of man. Do your work and use us in it. Yes, thank you for saving our soul from yes. a detriment of hell and destruction. Yes, thank you. Thank, thank you for giving us a certain place yes. inside the Father's bosom. Yes, Lord. Thank you for saving our relatives, our mm -hmm. children, sons, our daughter, yes, husband and wife and cousin. Save, Lord. Do it for your glory. In Jesus, name. In Jesus' name, thank God for Jesus. Yes. Amen. 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 Now, if we do things according to the Bible, we can't pass the offering plate. He said, come and bring yes. your offering. If it's $1,000, bring it. If it's one penny, bring it. If it ain't nothing, Put your empty hand in there, and I get to you. We'll give you something.